In 2007, I started the Inventors and Entrepreneurs Club of Suffolk County. Equating time, money, resources, I think that's a good definition of starting a business. Doesn't have With to be Lisa Broughton's help and the county executive, we went ahead and we started this group. I believe we've, we have over 750 people that have come through the doors in the last uh, almost four years now. The vision of the club was to really make these resources available and every month when people come in we give them referrals to the small business development centers. That's where you can get free business planning information and then there are any number of other free resources that we like to connect them with. The way to remember what in fact the patent is, is by thinking of it in terms of contracts. It really is an exchange of a promise for a promise. Oh, oh boy, it's gonna get profit. But ladies and gentlemen, let me tell you something. The patent system was designed to make things better. My name is Betty Tufariello. I am the founder of Intellectual Law, the law offices of PB Tufariello. We have a very different approach to the practice of intellectual property law. In this country, in the United States, intellectual property is actually organized into categories depending on who you speak to. Patents, trademarks, copyrights, trade secrets, privacy, and publicity rights. It is very important for entrepreneurs to understand intellectual property because that's what they're creating. They're creating property that in fact can be used to leverage their business, their invention, their idea, and bring it to the next level. The one thing that I try to do at all times, whether it is in a venue such as this one tonight, or alternatively, in my office on a one-to-one -one with my clients, I try to educate them as much as I can.